Hello everybody and welcome back to Ultimate Sims Guides. My name is Taylor and in today's video we are going to be discussing how to cheat the needs for your Sims in The Sims 4. Before we get started, if you find this video helpful and answer any of your questions, be sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel for more content like this every weekday. So let's just jump right in. So we've got our Sim here, Angela McCord, and she's, a, she's doing okay, you know, she's got a happy life, but she just wants her needs to be filled for a little while. And there are actually a number of ways that you can fill a Sim's needs in the game. So there is a way to fill a specific need. You can disable needs decay altogether and have them not go down or up at all. You can do a single Sim, or you could do the needs of your entire household or the entire world that you're living in. So we're gonna go through each of them, First, we're going to do how to fill a specific need. So the first thing you're going to need to do is hit Control shift c on your keyboard. And we can do testing cheats true to make sure that cheats are enabled. Then we are going to use this cheat, which is fill motive space motive underscore, and then the name of whatever need you're trying to fill. So you could do energy, and if you hit enter, the energy for her just went up. So that's how you would do that. So you could do fill motive space motive underscore bladder. It would fill her bladder need, for example. So that's one way that you can cheat specific needs if your sim's really hungry, but the rest of them aren't that bad. You also have the ability to just cheat the needs of one single sim. So what you're going to do is use that testing cheats enabled cheat at the beginning. Then you're going to go to whatever sim you want to cheat all of the needs for, and you're going to hold down shift and click on the sim. Then you're going to go to cheat need. And you can make happy, which will fill all of their needs, or you can disable or enable the need decay of just that sim. So if I were to hit disable need decay, her needs would not go down ever again, but we can just hit make happy and it will turn everything to green and she just went to very, very happy. To be able to fill the needs of an entire household, because she doesn't live alone, she does have her four of her children living in this house, there are two things we can do. The first is after typing in the testing cheat true cheat, there is a cheat that is sims.fill underscore all underscore commodities. And if you hit enter, that will fill the needs of the entire household. So that one is a little bit more annoying than the next method I'm going to show you. You can actually just go outside to your mailbox, a mailbox on any lot. It doesn't have to just be your lot. It could be any neighbor's lot. It doesn't matter. It just has to be a mailbox. And just like how you held down shift and clicked on the sim, you can hold down shift and click on the mailbox and go to alter needs. So we have fill needs of the household or fill needs of the world, meaning that you could fill the needs of every single person. So if you invited your entire neighborhood over and they were all at your house, but they were all a little bit moody, you could use this to fill the needs of the entire world and they would all be a little happier. So you can fill the needs of your household. You can also enable world needs decay so that no one other sims will ever like pee their pants or fall asleep in the street you know just the little things <laughs> and then you can also disable and enable household need decay so you do have the option to do it based on your household or based on a single sim so yeah those are all of the needs cheats that are in the sims 4 that you can use on any sim anywhere anytime it's great it's beautiful it's wonderful if you guys found this video helpful, be sure to give it a big thumbs up. And if you love The Sims and love to watch how-to videos like this all the time, be sure to hit that subscribe button down below. And I will see you guys next time. Bye, everybody.